Hey, welcome to this uh, computer easy computer fixes channel. Uh, this is a problem that shows up regularly at my clients. Um, I'm a tech guy here in Montreal, and um, I often get calls about a black screen with text and one of the problems that might see. Uh, you might have no boot device available, press enter to continue, or a variant of that. It's not always written exactly like that. Sometimes uh, I've seen no boot, no boot media, uh, no boot devices found, uh, whatever the message is, usually this means your main hard drive that boots Windows is um, not there. Why? A few things you can check. I would say 90% of the time it's uh, the hard drive died and it's just not available anymore and um, chances are that you'll have to replace it. Uh, but a few things, if you're a little uh, adventurous, if you have a, a desktop, you can take out one of the left side panel, go in and check to make sure that all cables are okay. Um, if you know what you're doing, you can also, also go into the BIOS of your computer and make sure that your settings um, show up the hard drive. Uh, how to go into the BIOS depends on your computers. Uh, on some computers, it's the delete key when you're at the uh, black screen at startup. Uh, it could be the uh, F2 key, F12 key. It depends, really depends. F1 on some computers. Every computer has a way to go into the uh, BIOS and um, look at your BIOS. Is your hard drive showing up in the list of uh, devices? Uh, for example, here in this window, it's saying trying to boot from SATA drive one failed. So uh, it could be simply a, pro a problem in the config of your computer. But keep in mind that that type of error message is very often a error message on replacing your hard drive. And we'll actually have a tutorial video showing you how to replace a hard drive in a desktop computer and also a laptop computer. So uh, you'll know how to do the job by yourself with these tutorial videos coming up. So um, if all cable seems okay, um, chances are your hard drive has died. And another um, message that you might get from uh, just before, if you see anything that says smart, uh, says that hard drive failure is imminent, that is usually a really important message letting you know, hey, um, your hard drive is about to crash. You better do something about it. That's probably the best way a computer hard drive can crash because you have time to actually change a hard drive and transfer your data from one drive to the other. Um, that's probably the cool thing about it. So um, if you get this error message, keep in mind that chances are your hard drive died and will need to be replaced. So. Um, you can either bring a computer in for um, you know a job to make it to fix fix it up by a tech guy. Uh, but if you look at our video slowly, you'll see that um, fixing your computer by yourself is not that big of a task. People think, uh, well, you know, I'm not sure I want to open a computer. Uh, computers are sur surprisingly easy to fix on some of the problems. Um, adding RAM is easy to do. Um, Changing a hard drive is usually quite easy to do. Uh, even installing Windows, it's more and more easy to do because uh, the more as time goes by, the more Windows can do stuff by itself and actually install drivers. So, uh, and it's a great experience. And just tell yourself something if your computer starts working, um, there's not much you can do unless you're really not careful to really make it worse. It just doesn't work anyways. So you can try for yourself and if it doesn't work, then go to the tech guy. At least you'll have more experience on how to fix it yourself. And that's always welcome. 
So uh, this was a quick little video showing you the type of messages that you might show up that says uh, hard drive failure, no boot device available, stuff like that. Um, so take a look at our videos. We'll soon have videos on explaining how to change our hard drive in a computer. And uh, it's quite easy to do in general. So uh, if you enjoy our videos, click the subscribe button. You'll be informed when new videos are online. We'll try to put lots and lots of videos. This is a new channel and I want to really, you know, put at least 100 to 150 videos in the coming month alone so that there's a lot of stuff to look at. So uh, this is going to be a great channel if you need help. If you have a computer problem, an error message of some sort, let us know. Mac, PC, uh, Android, iOS, and we will try to put a video with a solution online for you as soon as possible on our channel. So send us a private message and let us know with as much detail as possible what error you have. So uh, thanks for uh, watching and I hope you come back to the Easy Computer Fixes channel. Bye-bye.